first and foremost, I want to say, uh, say thank you to Mrs. Bischoff and Mr. Bischoff, Caitlin's parents. I'm not going to say thank you for tonight because, th- like I said, this is unbelievable. I want to say thank you for raising Caitlin the way she is. She's an unbelievable girl. She truly means the world to me, and that all started because of what you guys did. You know, from the time I came over and met you guys at your house, I was a little scrawny 18-year-old kid. All I cared, all I cared about was baseball. That's it, and then Caitlin. That's, those are the only two things in this world I cared about. And you guys treated me like a son from that day on. you should know that I admire you. You have such pride and passion in all that you do. Just being you will take you very far. To the groom. I have decided that you are a kind man with whom my sister will go through life hand in hand. I have now gained a brother who I trust to love and protect my best friend. It's all waiting for us Every turn in living color Heaven knows what we'll discover A story You know, as a dad, maybe some of you dads ask yourself this, but you know, when you have daughters, you start thinking things like, what kind of boy is she going to bring home, right? Because you wonder, all right? And, and I, I kind of made this checklist, made it years ago. So... Um, Ryan came over to our house, when was that, November? He called up and said he wanted to have a meeting with me and Miriam and talk about his intentions with Caitlin. And I went, oh no, what are we going to do? He knew. But anyway, kudos to Ryan, he drove over. Man, he did he have a plan. And I respected him for that. He laid it out, what he was going to do, had the job, had the budget, figured out how to buy a house figured out how to support Caitlin in all of this. So Caitlin, you found the right guy, and Ryan, you checked all the boxes. So thank you for that. Caitlin, what can I say? The day you were born, you had this look of determination that I will always remember, all right? You're competitive, <clears throat> you're funny, you're hardworking. You're a good sister to your sister, all right? <clears throat> About an hour before the ceremony, she gave this to me. Dad, Thanks for walking by my side today. No matter what, I'll always be your little girl. And I'll always whip your butt in basketball. (laughs) Kaylin, there it is. My letter to you, Kaylin Nicole. From the very first moment I saw you, I knew. I knew you were my wife. Since that moment, my life has changed for the absolute best. And today is the day we have dreamt for for a very long time. Let's enjoy every part of life here on out, knowing we can do everything together. I love you more than life itself. Love, Ryan. <clears throat> to my husband, best friend, forever best friend, soulmate. On our first date, we went to Pizza Hut and watched 21 Jump Street. Little did I know that it was the official start to one of the many dates in this amazing journey. I love how you care for me 
how you love me, and most importantly, I love you for just being you, Ryan James Johns. I love you with all my heart, Ryan James Johns. You made me better today and every day. like a few of us did tonight. I got to see four years of you guys like growing every single step. So I was single all through my time. I was the ultimate third wheel. I mean, literally everywhere I went, I was with these two. And I can't thank you guys enough for that. I can't. And I, I hate that we don't all live in the same building anymore. You know, I hate that we don't all live in the same apartment because I love you guys so much. And raise your glasses. To Ryan and Caleb. Treated with a heart wide open, like it's all I'm made to do. Take you, my love, take you a little bit higher. No one, you won't hold you a little bit tighter. I wanna pull you in close, want you to let it all go. Take you, my love, take you a little bit higher. A little Close my eyes, only you that I see. You're 